City of Troy right on the inside in the dark blue jacket. Where is Ryan Moore going to find himself at the end of the first furlong or two as Euphoric, his stable companion, dashes forward, the son of Frankel, with Los Angeles into second. Aidan O'Brien, one and two, setting a fast early pace, followed by Dallas Star. Ancient Wisdom not far behind these with Bellum Justum. On the outside table took Ambiente Friendly in the yellow, and we've lost one. One of them has um, unseated the rider. Uh, I'm not sure which one it is at the moment as they race across towards the inside and Euphoric is the leader from Los Angeles in second. On the inside Sayadati Sadati, Ancient Ambiente Friendly is right there as well and then just behind these Bellum Justum on the outside is Table Talk, further back then is Deer and Mile with Ancient Wisdom just ahead and then back in the field to City of Troy just to the inside following Mr Hampstead round as they head up the hill, Dallas Star is handy out the back God's Window with Dancing Gem and I and uh, also towards the outside or the inside then is Cambu in the red cap and Macduff as they race on towards the top of the race course and the one that went looked as though it was Voyage. Voyage unseated Pat Dobbs in the early stages and racing round the top turn now inside the final six and a half furlongs and Euphoric leads the way to Los Angeles followed by Sayadati Sadati on the inside of Dallas Star then Mr Hampstead Ambiente Friendly and Ancient Wisdom moving up a little bit in the Godolphin blue jacket they're followed then by on the inside Mr Hampstead off a table talk out wide McDuffer away back then City of Troy dark blue jacket Ryan Moore's trying to angle for a bit of a run getting off off the inside from God's window, then Cambu dancing Gemini and the nose banded Deer and Mile. They're preceded by the Loose Horse Voyage as they run round Tattenham Corner. And it's still Aidan O'Brien one and two. Euphoric from Los Angeles, who's well positioned. They're chased by Dallas Star, by Sayadati Sadati. Ancient Wisdom Ambiente Friendly is travelling very well. Yellow with the black striped sleeves and City of Troy now coming through under Ryan Moore. He's found a great seam as they run down the straight and City of Troy is quick enough very well to lead but Ambiente friendly trying to challenge as long as the loose horse doesn't get in the way then Los Angeles City of Troy leads the way in the Betfred Derby from Ambiente friendly in Los Angeles racing inside the final furlong City of Troy by two lengths to Ambiente friendly then Los Angeles what a comeback here by City of Troy City of Troy bouncing back three lengths clear a brilliant win in the Betfred Derby to win the derby, the three to one favorite. Plenty kept the faith. Ambiente friendly came there absolutely swinging. Rab Havlin must have thought he was going to win the yeah, derby. He, he would have thought that it's all his. He just had to be patient. Los Angeles was handy. We're just talking about tactics as well, Ed. City of Troy has never been dropped in a big field like that before. He's always just been allowed to use his stride and get on with the race in hand. And yeah, lines from uh, Rab Havlin. He thought for a moment he was going to win the race, and then he said he saw that pesky Ryan Moore <laughs> coming off his inside. They think that Ambiente friendly. It'd be better towards the end of the year.